Everybody, oh nope, over here. <laughs> I forgot I moved uh, the camera over. It used to be over there, so that it was kind of like a, you know, you're sitting on the couch with me kind of thing. Oh, that was the idea. Uh, but yeah, straight on. I look a mess, I'm sure, because I had to take. Uh, I was doing Prilosec for like a couple weeks, so I had to stop doing my acne medication. So I'm all broken out there, and I don't want to shave. When I'm all broken out, I end up cutting myself, so... Yeah, I look like a hot mess, but that's perfect for Doom. Because it's all about making hot messes. Hey, you know what I'm saying. Piles of blood and gore. I just did some jumping jacks. I'm a little... Uh, a little out of breath. And as you can see, if I move my head... Up there. I have my... Uh, I have my record player, which I've been playing the soundtrack to Doom 2016, which is like my favorite album for li listening to when I'm working, because there's not a lot of, the, it's not a lot of vocals, I mean they got like little sketches, kind of, you know, little monologues from like a demon voice, but um, otherwise, yeah, it's great, because it's just instrumental. Uh, yeah, so let's get into this, I haven't played a classic Doom in quite a while. Why is it not? 
From hint start. Oh, A. For some reason, the plus button is not start. I don't know. Uh, let's double check some stuff here. Sprint. Weapons are on the shoulders. Back. Move. Quick weapon switch. Okay. Audio. Uh, I think we're good there, right? Yeah, that's probably good. Um. Everything looks good. I can always, you know, turn that up if I'm having trouble seeing. And then. Yeah, always run. I don't have motion on this controller, so it doesn't matter. New game. Uh, well, let's go with Knee Deep in the Dead, which was the freeware version, so I've played it a lot. I keep looking over because I keep forgetting that you guys are just right there. I just gotta look down a little bit. Hello? Hello, do you see me? I do not see you. That's not how this works. Wow. Okay, that's moving a lot quicker than, uh, used to. I always play with the keyboard on crappy computers, so it would always have some slowdown going on. Okay, it's not... It's not unreasonable. Whoops. Up the, up the thing. Good, good, good. Oh, and that classic soundtrack. Alright, let's grab our first secret. Right over Chia. Oh, no. Right over Chia. <clears> hmm. <throat> What's this one again? Uh, but wait, what is the secret? I really haven't played this in quite a while, I guess. Ah, there it is, there it is, okay. okay. Whoop, real quick. There we go. You gotta use the spread to your advantage. Uh, I hear something else, but I think we'll be good. I keep, I keep trying to uh, look up and down, but you can't do that in Doom, which was something I've, I loved about for a long time because the idea of oh I gotta look up and down that's too difficult, too hard for me. I'm small brain mode, can't handle that. Whoops. We did it. What? Whoa. Yeah, it's moving so much faster than when I used to play it as a kid. Yeah, one of my earliest memories is actually um, sitting, sitting on my grandpa's knee, playing Solitaire and playing Doom, because those were the games on the computer at the time. He wanted to show me the games, and I, I loved it. Come on now, come on, go down. There we go. Oh, I'm doing this a little backwards. That works out just fine. Right. Already been through there. Don't want to miss any of the armor bonuses. But yeah, I'm not going for like 100% or anything. This is more of an any percent kind of situation. I think that's where I came up. Yep. Yep. I got nothing to. I guess I could beat him off. Hoopa! Hand to hand combat. It's never. never a bad time. You know? Give it a shot. Maybe you'll like it. I hope you'll like it. I mean, I don't know. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, that being said, then. Said quick change. Alright, well, let's. Yep. Right, sometimes I'll be a guy, but not in this first level. Ooh, I'm gonna be doing a lot of those little woo twists around. Because I just. Ugh. Yeah. It's been a while, and this control is very different from how I remember. Ugh. I remember to uh, sit up straight. I watched. Saw a video on TikTok that pointed out it's like what you want to do if you want to not 
screw up your back. You're sitting for a long time. Just to make sure that you s scoot, scoot your seat all the way back in your seat, and then have a a wide stance with your legs. And it's definitely helped, but it's a uh, yeah, it's just a matter of remembering to do it. It's like I always, I always kind of slouch and, bleh. but I got like a pillow here. It's kind of a little big, but I'm just gonna use it for a little bit, um, till I can justify spend thirty bucks or whatever on a new pillow. In fact, if I get my next, uh, whenever I get my next Twitch payout, whenever that may be, who even knows? Um. That's what I'll use it for. Get a nice little pilla for streaming. Oh, oh whoop, up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And yeah. Mm -hmm. No, nope. no key card yet. Ooh, it does feel nice to play this with a modern controller though, cause like. While it's taking a bit to get used to, it's super nice to just be able to zip around, no problem. Oh, my health is max, that's why I can't pick it up. Whoops. Gotta keep an eye out. There we go. Oh, oh, I see you there. Nice try, buddy. Better get up pretty early in the morning to get one over on me. I wake up way too early. I don't get enough. It's probably not healthy. Don't you judge me. Don't you judge me! I don't even know. I'm having a really good day. I, I finally got a uh, pretty chunky uh, voiceover project that I've I've had to delay a couple times because of health stuff and like other stuff coming up. Um, and yeah, that I kept having to tell them it's like I, oh, I'm gonna get it soon. I'm gonna get it soon. It was supposed to be done by the end of the year, and then I was like, well, maybe it'll take me a couple weeks, and then. Now we're like three weeks into the new year. I'm like, uh, so sorry, but I got it to him. I got it to him. Whoop, pretty much right before the stream. I also set up a Tumblr. I used to be on Tumblr, used to, I mean, God. Back in like 2013 in the heyday of Tumblr, I was like uh, deep into like um, the My Little Pony side of Tumblr. I ran a couple ass blogs, you know. Like you do. Um, and yeah, I would basically go on there, scroll through everything new that had popped up while I was asleep, then get lunch, reload it, and just do that again. And that was my whole day. I was unemployed and should have been looking for a job. But I just, it was depressing. I also, I went into the job force, like, right after, like, in 2010. So, like, right while we were still recovering from that old subprime housing loan crash. So, yeah, there was no work to be found. Oh, oh see. I love, um... I love, uh, the use of lights in this game. Stuff like that is real spooky. It's They didn't have a lot to work with because everything looks real silly. So they used what they had. Uh, I want to make sure. I believe I was supposed to pick up a key card somewhere in this situation. Apologies for the flashing lights, by the way. Not a lot I can do about it. That's just part of the game. Jeez Louise, this place is a friggin' maze. I have no idea where I'm meant to be. 
Ugh. Probably if I can't find it in another minute or two. Whoa, there's a guy. That's one of the things about Doom is there's these dead bodies everywhere, which are great for navigating because it means um, you can just kind of watch for like, you know, where are the dead bodies at? To figure out where you've been, you know? Although sometimes they'll just kind of be there on their own. Whoa, dip. Whoa, dip. Oh, jeez. Get down, get down. Come on now, don't do it, don't do it. Thank you, thank you. A thank you. A thank you very much. Uh. Hmm. Where are we headed? Oh, that's the end? Yeah, see, sometimes after the gold button door, there'll still be some guys. It, 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 go down, go down. There we go. All right, two of the, I think, 10 levels down. In his first chapter, I mean, I don't, I'll probably play more, or episodes, I think they're called. Or maybe it's less than that. I don't remember. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go as far as I can. This is just like a, ooh, 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 that's like a trick. Yeah, I'm gonna go as far as I can. I'll probably be able to beat the first episode in like an hour, hour and a half. But, uh... Yeah, after that, it's like, that's all I ever played because I was freeware, so I don't even know. I don't even know what the deal is after that. Like, I've played it before, but only, whoa! Only once or twice. In comparison to the dozens of times I've done this one. Why he say that? Talking some real guff. Oh, come on. Come on, quit hiding out. Quit hiding out. This guy behind me. Oh, they shot each other. Come on. Hey, there's a guy back here. Well, whatever, I'll come back around to that. Oof. Yep, my accuracy is pretty bad, but it always has been. I'm not very good at FPSs, even as old as this. Whoops. Take him down. Yeah, I want to, uh, marathon, um, Doom 2016 someday, but I'm gonna have to really practice it, because that one's, it's pretty tough. It's like, I've beaten it once, but it was like, that was a months long ordeal. Uh, I am gonna do a marathon stream. I think. Depending on how my health is, you know. I was so roughed up after last week because it was I was just so busy all week. Um, but I'm gonna, yeah, gonna try and gonna try and make it happen. Oh crap! Crap! Oh no! Oh rookie mistake! Rookie mistake! No! Okay. Well, we gotta start the whole level over again. Cause I got distracted talking about stream nonsense. Um. Uh. Oh, and you lose your weapons. I forgot. That's a thing. In Doom. Around the corner. I just wanna play. Come on, baby. Let's do it. All right, thank you. 
Ooh, don't fall in there. Don't fall in the soup. It'll be grouse. And also you'll die. But don't be gross, first and foremost. Ooh, uh, uh. Got the stream marker there, and I got a little distracted. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do for the marathon. Probably something shorter in the, like, six to eight hour range. Because I just, yeah, I haven't done it in a while. But I love doing a marathon. I truly do. They're super fun. Ah, come on, man. All right, that was my bad. Should've been paying attention. Um. Whoop. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think. Uh, it's in the games list, which let me actually drop here. Uh, game, game list. Yeah, there we go. So you can go see all the games. Um, all of the games that I have played and that I currently plan to play on there, and it'll say, you know, how I want to do it. So let me know out of those marathons, you know, one of them that's reasonable to do in like six to eight hours. If there's a particular one y'all want to see. Because I am trying to decide, hopefully something, you know, more relaxed, where it's maybe like a retro thing. Like, uh... Oh, I don't know. Um... Mario Kart? I could do, like, Mario Kart 64. Just, like, an any percent of the whole thing. That'd be cute. Shooting fish in a barrel. Shooting a barrel out of fish. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. They're doing a lot more damage than I thought they would. Okay. Playing it reckless. Gotta play it a little more safe here. Oh, those fireballs move real slow. Oh, that guy. Don't wanna miss. Ooh, careful. Don't wanna fall in the soup again. No, 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 no. That split pea soup. It's good for your bones, good for your digestion, but it's not good for your health. Ah! Oh, you actually have to... It doesn't just go. Well, that's good to know. Whoop, there we go. I'm getting pretty good at this beginning part, though. It's giving me a chance to really warm up to this uh, sensitivity. I always thought the, all of the like sounds that the monsters make, even the ones that are humanoid like that, real scary, real scary sounds, especially coming from a, a person. Huh, heard that. Wow. Ah. Okay. Right about there. Oh, you moved. I'll deal with him when he comes back up. Oh, I didn't. Ah, oh, he just gave me some guff. Well, uh, I'm not gonna open that. That's just a waste of ammo, honestly. It's like it's fun, but unless you're trying to get 100% kills, it's kind of unnecessary. And it just opens you up to getting hit more. So, yeah. 
Really no reason to do it. I also have a 100% run. I am not doing so. Back in the soup! Can't do anything there. Once you're in the soup, you're in the soup. That's just how it goes. Uh, let me bring this back down a little bit, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. I think. I don't know. Y'all can let me know. That's something about Twitch that always kind of annoys me. Is, uh, nobody wants to say when there's bad audio. Like, my first instinct always, if I hear, like, uh, if I catch a Twitch stream and they're having some kind of technical difficulties, I tell them. Because you might be like, oh, it's rude to let them know. It's like, no, they probably don't know. Like, if they... If they're having technical difficulties and they're not actively trying to solve them, then they probably do not know about it. Or if they do, they'd probably appreciate you telling them. Speaking of which. Or if they do. Okay, just checking that my audio is all good. I haven't been streaming from the computer side as much. But, uh, yeah. Like, I'd, I need to stop, like, troubleshooting for people for, like, hours at a time, like I do when I go on stream sometimes, because I'm just like, I just want to help. I want to be a friend. But I just don't have time for that anymore. And I really honestly should be charging for it. Like, with my experience level, giving that away for free is a little, uh, a little ridiculous. Ah, crap! Oh, man, this is tough. Take him out. Take him out. No! Ah! I selected the wrong weapon. Yeah! No! There we go. Jeez, man. I am worse at Doom than I remember. Or it could just be because this is, you know, this version. I'm playing, I should say, on the Nintendo Switch version because I it was on sale for like five bucks. And I was like, yeah, I'll spend five bucks on Doom. It's Doom. I'll get doomed for five dollars. Whoa. So I hope you all like my title. I think it was pretty funny. Um, points to anybody who knows what it's a reference to. It's not super obscure, but it's like one of those like, did you know? Uh, this guy said this thing one time and everybody, everybody was like, oh, that's from the other thing. You know, you know how they talk on Did You Know Gaming? I think he has a rocket launcher up there. Is there a way to get up there? There's gotta be, right? I don't know. Whoa! Oh, crap, crap, crap! Somebody behind me? No, okay. We're safe. I got lots of ammo. Don't got much health. Hmm? Gotta play it safe. Oh, well. Oh, yeah. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Okay. I gotta grab the health first. Grab some armor. That's why. That's why. No. No. Run, run, run. Just get out. Get out. Get out. Oh, he's back. Or rather, he's not dead. Oh. Okay. Ah, uh, health box. Yes. Ah, uh, health box. Ah, uh, okay. How's my driving? Call 1-800, I don't give a two. Go French yourself. Go French kiss yourself in the back end of your mama's pickup. I don't even care. Come on now. Do it. Okay. 
Okay, okay. Got all this stuff. Whoop! Oh, who's firing? Who's shooting? Whoa! Oh, hey, hey! Oh, why can you go in the soup? Don't let me be in the soup. Ah! I got so far that time. Man, I don't want to have to turn the difficulty down, but I'm really, really screwing this up. This game's pretty tough. It's a lot tougher than I remember, that's for sure. Ah, was who said that? Oh, this guy. Thank you. Thanks for giving a gun. Now I'm gonna shoot everyone. There's a demon here. He's not a pal nor a confidant. Thank you for giving this gun. Dooming every single fortunate son. Yeah, ding, ding, ding. Zing, ding, 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 ding. Oh, there's my old. There's a guy over here. Yeah, I got him. Alright, we're doing much better this time. My hands are getting real sweaty. I had some uh, tea while I was recording earlier. And yeah, I've gotten really sensitive to caffeine ever since my health issues earlier last year. Um, which I'm doing better. And like, yeah, I'm still kind of sensitive, but I was able to drink like an energy drink the other day and I got, you know, I didn't get too much jitters. So that was progress. Uh, not that I want to do a crazy amount of caffeine, but you know, it was at the point where if I had just like a regular coffee or an espresso, I would just be like good, just dead, like completely zonked out, zombified for like the whole day after that. So I don't want that. That I don't want my body to be so weak that I can't handle a coffee. Man. As a kid, I never really used the barrels that much, but honestly, they're super- No! Oh, are you kidding? How do I keep doing this? How? I, like, never fell into that as a kid. It's also, I feel like with the keyboard, the original one was not this sensitive. I could probably turn the sensitivity down, but it's like... At this point, I'm kind of used to it. Okay. All right, now that I'm a little more uh, aware of what is happening in these levels, kind of do it a little better. Okay, took himself out. He's trying. He's trying. He's dying. He's lying. And he's frying. Up some spam. For a delicious sandwich. A little bit of spam and egg. Ooh. -y. I'm getting really into spam lately. I try not to do it too much because it's very salty. Um, but so good. A little fried spam, dude. Spam and eggs. A little slice off some thin slices of spam and fry them up till they're crispy. Ooh. I also, I've been uh, doing. Okay, let's take it slow. Cross the thing. Uh, I don't gotta worry about that guy too much. Um, but yeah, I did, uh, uh, I did some breakfast crunch wraps at home, um, the other, the other day, Saturday, and yeah, instead of sausage or, uh, 
bacon or whatever. I use some spam, some fried spam. Ooh, man. Oh, so good. Toasted up some hash browns in my toaster oven. They were extra crispy crunchy. Got some nacho cheese in a can from the store. I got, uh, if you do that, I keep clipping the mic, excuse me. I'm getting real excited. Um, I got, I f what is it, Old El Paso, I think. Ooh, 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 ooh. Just so fast, so fast. Pachoo, pachoo, pachoo. Um, Old El Paso, or no. Old Mission? Mission mission Tortillas? I don't remember what the brand is, but there's a particular brand of tortillas. It's one of the big brands, for sure. Um, and uh, they make now grande-sized, so like the huge like chipotle-sized tortillas. Uh, it's like five bucks for six of them, so they're not cheap. But that's what, if you want to make a breakfast crunch wrap at home, that's the way to go, because it'll fit perfect. And all you gotta do, you don't even need the grill. You don't need a panini press, none of that. No George Foreman grill, none of that, man. You, All you do is you get you your pan, right? You get a cast iron pan. And if you got two cast iron pans, that's great. That's what I do. But if you got at least one cast iron pan, Put it, uh, put it in a different pan on the bottom, or, you know, one of your cast irons, whichever one's bigger, uh, on high heat, and then toss the cast iron on top to weigh it down and really crush it flat. Let it go for, like, 15 to 30 seconds. Perfect. Perfect crunch wrap. Get it exactly right. And it takes a little practice, you know, you might over toast a couple of them, but you just gotta check. You just gotta keep checking. Just practice. And since you're making it at home, you can toss an avocado, you can toss in whatever you want. You can have all the you can have all the extra ingredients you want, baby. A little salsa. A little scrambled egg. It's good. It's good stuff. I personally, I love getting those big tortillas because I like putting a lot of veggies in my burrito, especially a lot of greens, some spinach and spring mix. So good for you. Um, and a little bitter to offset, you know, some like more rich stuff you might have, like your nacho cheese and eggs. Mm. Doing like a, a rich scrambled egg with some bitter greens. So good. So good, dude. Um, but this guy behind me there's several guys behind me um eh, eh, eh. there we go ooh bunch of stuff oh jeez that was a lot of flashing um whoops I see you back there uh but yeah, it's like, it's kind of hard to do the, a lot of greens in your, whoop, in a standard burrito tortilla that you buy at the store because, wow, because it's so big. Or they're so fluffy. Now. Mm -hmm. They're just like so uh, bulky and fluffy that you can't, uh, you can't get it closed. So you get the bigger tortilla. That's all good. Come on. Get I want to play on stream sometime. I had this uh, this spawn game for PS2. It was pretty pretty sweet. The one problem with it is that the level design was real bad. It was super hard to navigate, and I couldn't beat it because there's like one of the later levels. You're in Central Park, and it's awesome. There's like crazy like fey creatures running around and there's like demonic like deer hopping through it's cool but i got lost i got lost and i couldn't tell the difference between any spot because it all just looks the same oh snap rocket launcher baby 
rocket launcher, baby. Baby zoo rocket launch. Everyone you know is gonna get a rocket lunch. Would you like some rocket? Have them for your lunch. I've been listening to a lot of steam powered giraffe lately. They just did, um. Ooh, careful. Don't wanna let. Whoa! Oh. That's not some sort of creature. That's that's a friend. Whoops. Gotta be careful of that. That's what I want. Um. But yeah, they did their 15th anniversary live stream concert on YouTube, which you can go watch for free. It was super fun. I definitely recommend it. Um, it's way nicer than when I had to spend like a 50 buck pay-per-view. I don't think it was that expensive, but I had to... Well, I didn't have to, but I did uh, buy the pay-per-view for their 10th anniversary concert, which was cool. It was live. They got like everybody back. They got the John. They got Upgrade. They got Hatchworth. Um, yeah, I'm still catching up. I, I've listened to the Vice Quadrant. It's okay. You know, it's not bad. It's just none of the songs are, like, super catchy in the way that uh, a lot of their older songs are. So while they're good, they're just so, like, story heavy with that one that I'm like, eh, which is probably why I kind of dropped off from them. Oh, geez, these guys, these guys terrified me as a kid. The bull demons, right? I think so. They're, they were just so scary. Uh, they just move so fast and they're so big and angry looking. They look like they're in pain because they're all like pink and raw. Look like a dang, somebody waxed a gorilla. Put some horns on it. No, that wouldn't be too bad for my mantle piece. Uh, where can I catch one of them? Um. <laughs> uh, whoops. Uh oh. Ah! Hold on. My roommates. I think you're texting me. About dinner. Uh, hold on. I'll I'll take a break real quick, so don't go anywhere. Don't touch the internet dial. I'll keep looking over where the old camera was. Don't go anywhere. Don't touch the internet dial. I'll be our back right after this.
I'm back. Got that all worked out. Wow. I am way louder in my headphones than I realized. Okay. Let's get back to it. Whoop. Hey, who's shooting? Hey, shoot. Get through the gaps there. It's dark. Uh, it's dark. Whoa. A naked feller with his dang old buns standing, standing out. Cheeked up on a, was it a Monday? I ain't a fan of that. Yeah, yeah. There's the end. So let's just do it. We're... We're doing casual mode, guys. Any percent. All right. Oh, skimmed in a little bit. All right, nothing more from the roommates. Again, Bojangles. Never had Bojangles. Um, my roommate, who's like lived here longer, says it's great, but yeah, there's not any really nearby, but uh, they had to swing down to Jacksonville for an appointment. Um, so I guess there's a Bojangles on the way or they're going out of their way for it because they like it that much. Ooh, there there it was. Uh, I think they're called Sprite. The Invisible Bull. So scary. Ah, I should have waited. Yeah, that's fine. But, um, yeah. I set up a new tumbler. Especially because it sounds like they kind of backed. Oh, you're right. I don't have the yellow key card anymore. It sounds like they, you know, rescinded all their stupid policies that they've made. I mean, not all of their stupid policies, but a lot of them. Um. Whoops. Go down. Go down. Uh. Well, yeah, I remember. I'm having vague uh recollections of playing through this part while I was watching. Somebody talk about the board game Spirit Island, or I might have been thinking of the. I might have been listening to the Shut Up and Sit Down podcast. Nope. Completely backtracked. All right. Um, but yeah, weird sense memory. I unfortunately don't have it included yet. But for my other socials, I have set up a uh, a command for that as well. There you go. You can see all of my various social media accounts. Oh my god! Oh, I spent all the weekend working on this project. I'm not gonna say too much yet because there's still it's still really up in the air. We don't know how long it's gonna take, but it's just it's a guy that uh, I met through Casting Call Club, and he had a super cool idea for this show super into it and yeah we're just we're collaborating I spent like several hours on a uh, on Saturday like I waited until 8 p.m. and I was like I'm gonna crack into this and I'll just I'll write a few pages wrote the whole thing wrote the whole draft and it wasn't super long but yeah it felt great because it was short enough that it was like finishing a screenplay <laughs> I've started so many screenplays and never finished them because they're always I'm always going for movies and they're so long and it's like I realize it's like no they don't have to be I can make I can make something much shorter uh what oh right I got the yellow key card ah see saw that coming um but oh it's behind me Ah! 
But uh yeah. I, I wrote the wrote the draft. Um tomorrow I'm gonna This is a tip for all you people out there who are thinking of writing or working on anything really. Uh do it. Do whatever you're doing. And if it's not something ephemeral like, you know, cooking or uh performance. Just like like write your first draft and then step away. Just put it down, step away, don't even look at it for like a couple days, at least two. Longer is even better, but if you're too excited, you know. But yeah, you need a little creative distance. I think I learned this from parental Floss. Yeah, I think this was in Lyrics 101. But it's like, yeah, if you take a few, mi a few days to just like step back and then come back to it, because if you come right back to it while you're still stoked, you're a little too attached to the ideas. Um, you're a little too in the same headspace, you know? So it's good to come back a while later. Right, I gotta find the button for that. Uh, ooh, there it is. Okay, I just gotta walk onto here. Got it. Um, but you gotta give yourself some time to put yourself in a new headspace so that when you come back to it, you're not looking at it completely objectively, but you're looking at it, you know, with less, uh, you're, you'll be more willing to, like, make big changes because you'll understand, you know, you'll have a better perspective on, like, well, uh, this was that or that, and then re understanding why, you know, your choices maybe weren't the biggest, uh, bestest choice. Come back here. There we go. Um, which is always a good idea. So... Yellow key card, that's right. Um, so yeah, be sure to just take some time. And, uh, but yeah, I'm really stoked because it's, I don't want to, you know, to my own horn, but sorry, that's stupid. Um, God, there's so many guys. Ah, too many guys. Too many guys. Knee deep in the dead indeed. Ah, dang it. Okay. Um. Oh my gosh, it's turning out terrible here. But uh yeah, I think it's it's pretty good. I think it's a really cool idea. It's not my idea. But uh I honestly I love how our process ended up working out, which is that I um uh, he wrote out what was a pretty straightforward kind of thing, you know, where it was just like the the mean potatoes, like this is what happens, this is the story, and it was a cool story, but it was also like it didn't have a you know the way it was being told was very like this is what happened, there you go, and it's like um, and he was gonna like do more to it in another draft for sure, but um, yeah taking that and just knowing all the details when I went to my draft I was like oh now I know everything that's happening I don't have to say all of that stuff but I know that it's there in the background and I can allude to it I can work with that and it just yeah it made for I, I basically truncated it using the same details in a way that made it so that it was very um it felt very fleshed out and it felt like the, it wasn't closing off the universe, which is like something I, I hate. My biggest pet peeve in fan fiction, because I've I've read a lot of fan fictions, and some of them are really good. Some of them are, you know, not so good. Um, and my biggest peeve is when you're writing a fan fiction, and you say have characters reminiscing about the past, right? But then the only thing that they talk about is stuff that happened in the original property. Like, they, they, like, it's closing off the universe. It's being like, oh, this is all that's happened. 
and it's like it's a crutch because you're um you're just like padding out your story by you know reminding people of stuff they liked that was in the original property rather than writing your own stuff and risking people you know not liking it and it's like i get it it's really harrowing to write whoa to write your own stuff and know that you know it's all gonna come down and like yeah there's like a lack of confidence as a uh, an inexperienced writer where you're like I don't know if this is good enough and it's like I get that I've had that and I still have that sometimes um, like I've when I presented this draft I was just like dude this is so good I'm so stoked on this and I was like oh that sounds really boastful oh you know it's probably not that great and it's like why'd I do that why'd I diminish my own accomplishments I'm really proud of the draft I'm really proud of what I wrote and I think um, I think it's really good, so I should be proud of that. I should just commit to that. But, uh, that being said, yeah, it's like, that's such, if you want to make something new in this universe, that's your opportunity. That's your opportunity to be like, hey, remember this thing that didn't actually happen in the original story? You know, how... How cool is that? You gotta be like, this is something that happened to them that you guys didn't even know about. It's like, whoa. I didn't even think about that. And it's like, yeah. Yeah. Like, have the characters, have their experiences be real, have their experiences inform what you're talking about, but also give them new experiences. Like, that's half the fun. Ain't it? I'm supposed to be up here? Maybe not. Oh, oh, hello. Oh, that's it. Well, where do I go now? That looks like a door, but it's not opening up. Hmm? Oh, hello. Yeah, I'd like to get through first episode. My voice is starting to get a little a little croaky. It was already there was like a lot of shouting in the script I recorded today. And it was a long script. It was like ninety-four pages. Which with the formatting, it was only like three or four lines at most per page. But yeah, some of them were real shouty and real uh Real rough on the old chords. Still not fully, fully, I think, recovered from last week. I'm mostly, not fully. Oh, that's what we did, eh? Open that up. I don't mind too much because he's melee. Yep, get him from a distance. Oh, there we go. Oh, I hear him. I hear him. You hear him? I love that guy. Oh god, they just come right at you. It's so scary. I don't like it. Oh. There we go. Gibbed him. Absolutely fragged. Bonk. Come on. You gonna make me go down the dark hallway? You gonna make me go down the dark hallway right over there? I do not like it. No, uh, no, sir. No, sir. Not a fan. Wow. Jeez, yeah, I can barely see anything. This would be imp- Oh, look at that perfect line of imps I made. Look at that. Perfect little line. Sorry, that's stupid. Again, why do I do that? If I think something's funny, I should just let it be funny. Rather than apologize. Apologize for being awesome. Yeah. What is this? How I Met Your Mother? 
How I met your papa. Oh, it's one of these guys. Ah. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Did I get him? Wait. Not you. Oh, I did get him. Hey, not you. What? Uh, what did that do? What'd that do? Oh, nothing good. Whoa! Yeah, I always played on the easy difficulty, I guess, because I don't remember- Whoa! I don't remember these guys popping up this early. I think this is... Um... Yeah, this is where the first, like... Oh, that's what happened. This is where the first... Oh, come on, dude. This is where the first, uh, like, bulls come up in my, uh, my other playthroughs, usually. God, I can't see anything. Uh, no! No! What's happening? No! Oh my god, I think that was the exit, too. Ah. Jeez, that guy does so much damage right out the gate. I can't believe this. Well, at least they all came to me, so that's... That's helpful. That's real nice of them. Good job, guys. Hey! What bills you be paying? What bills you be paying to throw fireballs at me in my own house? I hear somebody. I think he's past the door. Yep. Okay, um, gotta go get the yellow key card first. Okay, go along up here again. Be careful not to fall. There's guys. Whoa. Whoa. Hey. Whoa. Hey. GBH, this feels really nice, the way this controls. It's like, it's really hard to get used to because I'm so used to the keyboard version. But, um... Now that I'm a little in the groove, it's like, dang, look at this. Look at I'm flying. Flying right across. I'm flying, Peter. From the, this, this Peter Pan. Okay, this is the area where things get real dicey. Okay. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. Come on down. Come on down, son. New contestant, come on down! Get absolutely shredded, my dudes. God, oh my god, so many guys! See, this would be a great time for the rocket launcher if I still had it. So I'm pretty sure I could have gotten the chainsaw back in the, uh... Level two, I think? Like, you can get it pretty early, but if you miss it, you end up not getting into, like, the pretty late. Ah, my eyes watering a little bit. Now I used to have the studio light right in my face. It's been a while, you know? I to get some shades. Some, a little bit of tint. It doesn't have to be, like, super dark, but, like, yeah, this... This light is getting me. There we go. Oh man, that left me with nothing. Two health, no armor. 
My tooth kind of hurts. That's unrelated, but... I mean, it's a fact. It's just... It's it's happening right now. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, well, it's more my gums, I guess. I've had some gum problems, so... I'm trying, uh... Trying to hold it together. I floss. I didn't for a long time. I did not floss. Like, I'm sure a lot of you also did not. And I get it, man. It sucks. It's inconvenient. It's uncomfortable. It hurts when you're first doing it. But if you, like, if you do it, your gums end up in great shape. Uh, it stops hurting. Like, it's still not super pleasant. And it only really takes, like, a couple minutes. It's a pretty, pretty quick little chore. And come on, man. Can't take two minutes for your dental health. Two minutes a day. Easy peasy. No, no excuse. Keep your gums healthy. Going into this part, it's just a handgun. Well, I I'm gonna get a shotgun off one of these guys. Whoop! Ah! Oh, dizzy dog. Okay, let's give it one more shot, and if I can't get it this time... If I can't get it this time, then I'll, I'll lower the difficulty. I don't want to, because this is just the medium difficulty. This is what most people do, but it's like... I'm a wiener. I'm bad at <laughs> FPS, man, and I'm scared. It's a scary game. What do you want from me? I'm just a little guy. I'm not a little guy. I'm actually quite large. I'm 6'2". 185-ish. Been trying to gain some weight. Because I, lo I lost a lot of weight because of those health problems. It really messed me up. So I've been, I've been slowly gaining some back. Which is good. But it's also like... Man. It's, it can be tough. It can be really tough. Like, I eat plenty. I exercise, but, you know. It's also, I mostly do, like, cardio. So maybe I'm, like, just losing losing weight through exercise. I'm losing some of the fat and maintaining some of the muscle. I just gotta get back to the gym. I've been paying for it. I didn't go almost at all last year, and I paid for it the whole time. Oh, Lord, that's, like, what? Uh... For like 400 something bucks down to toilet but they got me they got me with that contract man um here we go there's a guy come on out come on out to meet me come on out to play whoop Come on now. Just use some pistol ammo. Okay. Um. Yeah, just got bulk up. I was doing like protein smoothies for a while and they were they were tasty and really, really bulking me up, but my heartburn can't handle a liquid diet, you know what I'm saying? I gotta have some kind of some kind of solid carbs, some kind of bread or something to soak up that ace. Soak up that ace. Well, actually. Let me go around this way. Just like I'm 
move, I gotta move. I think that's the big thing, is that I underestimated how much you gotta move, and that's that's true in Doom 2016 as well. You gotta keep your dang, your dang feet a-going. You stand still, you're basically toast. Okay, uh, let's not be dumb. I think it's always fascinating, the grunt style characters. In this case, I'm talking about the imps, even though they're, they're like the third strongest, uh, enemy, but, their whole thing is that they're not really dangerous on their own, but they will. If they gang up on you, dude, they can really, like, do some uh, teamwork damage. Nice. Yeah, if you can get one of the bulls right next to a barrel, it'll take them out in one, but... God, watch out for those shotgun guys. They can do so much damage. Here we go. Thankfully, if it's imps, fireballs are bright and move slow enough that you can dip, dive, duck, and dodge. There we go. Okay. Oh, and there's... Do we have a sprite in here? Whoop, yep, there he is. It's hard to tell because it's so flippin' dark. health. Whoa! Uh, almost got me. Nice try, bud. Uh, there we go. That's what I want. I can get him coming at me. I have the advantage of, uh... Well, knowing which way he's coming from. Did I leave any... I mean, I probably wouldn't have, but... Any health drops. Keep crunching forward. I gotta make sure keep my neck upright. I can't see. I can't see. This is where I died last time, I think. Ah, get out of my way. Get out of my way. I see it. I see it. Let me out. Let me out. Yes. Woo! Oh my goodness. Oh, I got a secret. I don't even know what that was. All right. I am just about dead. Thankfully, they give us plenty of goodies right at the beginning. Get out of here, dude. Come on now. Come on now. Hey, nice try. Getting a little more serious now. Being tactical. Checking around the corners. Yep, something like that. Here we go. Dude, 
dude, yeah, I'm really realizing on these this higher difficulty than I've normally played this on, like... Doom 2016 is super faithful to the feel of this. Oh my god, so many shotguns. Like, this is exactly what Doom 2016 feels like. You're just juking around and jiving. Some ammos. Don't want to miss out on any of these goodies. Why, they were holding them just for me. What a bunch of friendly, generous neighbors. Well, I'm, uh, I can't say that I can, I can give them much back, but you know how it goes. Right, this level, I remember now. There's some good stuff in there. Uh, I'm going for it. Whoa, oh, wow. oh, ho, ho, sneaky tricks. Okay. Survived that. You know what? Nice try. Let's just switch to the shotgun so I don't waste all my chain gun on small fry. Whoa! That happens a lot more in the higher difficulty is the uh, the amount of times that they just kind of jump on you. Hmm. Some cool stuff down there, but I'm not going to risk it. I don't know what happens. All right, I got the blue. Uh, which isn't over here. Step back this way. Uh, nope. Red's over there. Whoa. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. Go down. Go down. There we go. Whoa. Something else around here, but I don't know where it's at. Hear him. Nice try, buddy boy. Whoa. Oh, who was that now? Whoa, they're just coming across. They're just running across like it don't even hurt. Why can you guys run across the soup? I need a special suit to run across the soup. where I'm going to go if I get the rad suit, but it's not so rad that I don't have the suit, honestly. Go down. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, jeez. Whoa. Oh, come on. Come on now. Whoa. Okay, we're switching to the chain gun. Okay, I'm remembering the directions of the, uh, whoop, the weapons now. It's basically the, the better ones are, uh, you go right for better, left for last. Right for really cool, left for a loser one. I don't know. Uh... If y'all can come up with a mnemo- Oh! I didn't even see that there was chat going on. I was so focused. Hey, Vinny. Rudy tooty shooty shooty. Yeah, I gotta get the soup suit. Gotta get the soup suit. Or what's- What is it that Corey calls it? He, uh... The, like, coverall. You know, where you're, like, fully locked in. Sort of, like, flight suit thing. He calls it a poopy suit. And it's like, yeah. 
text you from from the poopy. Whoa! Oh, come on! Weapons grade baloney, right there. All right, let me grab the shotgun. Yeah, I have not ever really gotten this far on this difficulty in Doom, so this is... I'm doing pretty well, but it's also, like, a very different experience for me. It's also... Playing it on console, it moves so much faster than it did on the old-ass PCs I was playing on. Oh, I should have saved that now that I know what what's up. Uh, make sure to grab the chain gun first first before I grab it. Okay, keep moving, keep moving. Serpentine, serpentine. Uh. Oh, you too. And yeah, these shotgun guys are like deceptively um they seem like they're minor because they're just still mostly human but like they're really tough all right then we'll switch back to shotgun uh yeah exactly Whatever is in your friggin' gonk brain. The bowl of soup in your skull. Aw, oh, yeah, look at that accuracy. Getting pretty good at this. It helps that I only have to deal with uh, two dimensions. Oh, I remember how this went. Like, I don't have to look up or down. Yeah, I like this, uh... I like having my camera like this, but also it means that I'm less likely to look over at chat. <laughs> yeah. That classic meme. Um, whoops, nope. Ooh, although, I'll have to remember that these are all here for later. Come on now. Come out the darkness at me. Come out the darkness. You come out of the darkness and I will find a way to take you down. That's right, right there. We gonna go down the river, we gonna get ourselves some gumbo, some red bean and rice, and we gonna play some boo-ray. That's right, that's right. You know, they love the boo-ray in the NBA. I don't know, well, it's probably because they can't afford it. Boo-ray is an expensive game to play. You doubling your antis left and right. I don't got the yellow card. I'll come back with it. That'll be fine right there. Ah, uh, that's not the way to go. No, oh, I see you there. You can't trick me. No, no, no. The gumbo is the soup. Come on, what you got going on? You don't know the gumbo, the soup? It's a delicious soup. You put it on some rice. Or you just eat it as is. It's delicious. I should make some gumbo. Hmm. I haven't had any in quite some time. Whoop! Oh, it's one of these guys. I never really see them until they're right on top of you. Just gonna get them through the slats. Oh, there's the, the soup suit. A soup suit. Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. There we go. Now we can go 
down the the cur the curves. Oh man. Maybe I picked up something and didn't see it. That's a mite disappointing. That's quite all right. Make this area a little easier to deal with. I have to keep remembering that the suit is not armor. Because it feels like, oh, the soup doesn't hurt me, so. I'm invulnerable. It's like, nope, not invulnerable. Just safe from radiation. And caustic chemicals. Now, oh, I see what you're saying. Uh, Matt. Well, I guess that'll help if I end up not being able to find my way, but it's not that confusing of an area. And a lot of flashing lights in this game. I never even realized. Ah. There we is. There we were. Go down. Thank you. I. Ooh, wait a minute. Whoa. Get down now. Careful of these corners. Never know when somebody's gonna pop out. Okay. Pop out. Yeah. Oh, that was the map. What did that switch do exactly? Well, looped back on myself. And whoa. Oh, that shotgun's having a bad time. Nope. Not there. Over here? Oh, 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 there's something. There's something. Whoa! <laughs> Getting some genuine jump scares in here. I haven't felt that from Doom in a long time. I guess it was a good idea to uh, play this on the higher difficulty. Whoa! Hey, nice try. Oh, crap! Oh, there's a bajillion guys. Just gotta go, gotta go. Whoa, oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go crazy. Hmm. We're gonna have to head back out there. Thankfully, I, I don't know how, but I got some health back. Uh, what's the way back out? Nope, not here. Not there. Whoop. <laughs> oh god, there's a fly. Or a mosquito or some. Maybe it's a gnat? I don't know. There's the blue door. Which is how I got in. That's the way out. Whoa! Uh, do do do. Whoa! Whoa! No 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 no! Not in the soup. Not in the soup. Okay. Ah. Oh. Okay, everything's looking good. Whew. Sometimes you gotta take a little breather, you know? Sometimes. I should run back to the beginning for all that, those health drops that I didn't get. In fact, yeah, I'm gonna go do that. Ooh, there's one. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay, we're good then. With that. Ooh. Oh, man, this game is so good, dude. Like, Wolfenstein, pretty good, but it's, like, very basic in comparison. This is just genuinely really great. Oh, crap. Squandered all the health I got. Peekaboo. 
Uh, peekaboo. A peekaboo. Bam! I got him. Alright. Stop this, Vinny. Stop this tomfoolery. I will not be spoken to in such a way on my stream. I won't have it, sir. Now, why am I going in here? I. Oh, oh no. Okay. You best behave. I'll time you out, boy. You get a little rambunctious, you know, and you just need a little break. You get a burrito whether you want to or not. Oh, the spikes in those in the packs look so painful. Well, let's. All right, went in there. Can't open it. Whoops. Really blended in there. Ah, that's how I'm supposed to do it, huh? All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't care how true it is. I didn't ask for it. This is not the environment I want to work under. We don't have an HR manager. My only retaliation is to time you out. Oh my god, oh my god. Sloppy, sloppy work. Whoa! Hey, nice try. Okay. Whew. Alright, is that it? Well, there's a health. Ah, there's a whole other area still. Alright, alright. Whoop. All right, we're switching the chain gun. Whoa. Ah, keep hitting myself with the barrels more than I hit anybody else. God, stop. Whoa. No! I mean, you can talk. I'm just saying, though, to keep your, keep your comments professional. Is Mike in a good position? I don't want to be blocking my face too much. Well, it's been an hour and a half, so I'm gonna, I'll take a break. Um, yeah, take a break, run an ad. Maybe if I come back to it fresh, it'd be better. We'll see. Um, I think I might turn the brightness on this too high is why it's really hurting my eyes. We'll find out. Um, but yeah, I'll be back in just a bit. So don't go anywhere. Don't touch the internet dial. I'll be our back with more Doom in just a minute. Okay, okay.
Okay, I am back. We are. Oh, let me get cozy. Tilt that up just the tiniest bit. A little bit more. A little bit. Yeah, perfect. Bring this in a little bit. There we go. All right. Just dig time. Uh, yep, my mic is back on. Uh, make sure that I got my posture correct. Don't want to throw out my back or anything. Resume. Okay. So yeah, I think this is the second to last in this episode, so I will uh I will finish out the episode for sure. Cause the last bit, I'm pretty sure, like the last chunk, it has some really tricky enemies. Like it has the, the first couple hell barons. But it is not super long. So yeah. And it's like it's Monday, you know, miscellaneous Mondays tend to be shorter trying stuff out in this case you know seeing what a uh, classic doom is about all right we're just gonna grab this grab that and then use the barrels to our advantage oh, come on keep moving keep moving i got rusty in the couple minutes that i was away ah oh. Dog water showing, dude. SMH. Ah, oh, worst yet. Worst yet. V2. I have considered a VTuber. As you can see, I have my uh, Fursona character in my thumbnails and stuff. In my branding, that's uh, Lee Ohm, the lion. Lee Ohm. It's, it's stupid, uh, but uh, y'all gotta call me out when I do that, when I diminish myself. I am trying not to do that. I'm trying to be positive about my output into this world as an artiste, and I think, yeah, that's one of the, the first steps is not doing that nonsense. Oh my god, I hit myself with the barrel. Maybe I should just clear this out. Mm, yeah, I don't know. Um, yeah, I'd maybe want to get get uh, them as a VTuber character. That'd be cute. I'd want it to be like Chester, you know, that style. Very cartoony kind of VTuber. Or maybe like a really simple one that's just like, you know, goes between two different images doesn't have to be fully animated but something like that I think would be pretty cute like if you agree subscribe if you agree pay me money if you agree I mean I guess that's what that's what subscribing is is if they agree with my branding choice then uh, they show their support through the subscription Hey, yo, Vinny. Uh. Vaguely. I'm trying to get more art, honestly, because I was on a project and they were like, do you have an OC? And I was like, oh, yeah, I actually do. And it's like, um, D will, will do, like, holiday ones. For like Christmas or Halloween, it's one that we do a lot. Um, but yeah, I've got a few in mind. Okay, I just gotta keep moving, quit guffing around with these barrels, quit getting caught on stuff. That's really what keeps killing me. I can get the barrels, that'd be sweet, but that's like... Priority number two. Priority number one is just moving. Ah. Uh, 
Oh, send me that program. I'll look into it. I'm thinking, here's my thought. Um, I don't think that I'm not going to do camera because I do enjoy being on camera. It gives me a lot of possibilities to emote in a way that I don't think VTubers really can. I know people like VTubers, but it would be cool to just have, if my computer can handle it, uh, just a little, little Leom in the corner cheering me on, you know? Of course, I think that'd have to be a little more adaptive to, for it to emote correctly, but we'll see how it goes. What? Um, no, no, you can't, you're not gonna be able to send it here. Send it, send it uh, on the Discord server in like the, the off-air chat. Yeah, well, yeah, the, put it in the the server so that other people can find it too. Yeah, I'd appreciate that. But uh, Vinny, you got Amazon Prime? Because if you got Amazon Prime, you get a free Twitch Prime sub a month, and uh, if you ain't used it, I mean, uh, I'd appreciate it. You get bonuses like, uh, I mean, currently there's no major bonuses. The moats are all free right now, because otherwise nobody would use them, and I'd rather they get used. And uh, everything else is pretty much just, you know, open for now. Uh, I think you get other parts of the Discord server, but like you are the most active person, so I don't think it'll end up mattering that much to you. Yeah, maybe that's part of why nobody subscribes. Or the cheers. The cheers you were doing the other day are actually very, very helpful. So any of that stuff, I'd really appreciate it. I do get paid for the bits that you spend. Yes, yes, use. Use the emoticons. Yeah, whatever. I mean, I'm not saying like, don't go broke or nothing. But if you got if you got bits already, or if you are already signed up to Amazon Prime, then if your Twitch and your Amazon are linked, you should just get like a free sub that you can give to anybody every month. Dark. Whoa. Dip. Getting sloppy. God, I gotta go through all the maze crap again. Ah. We'll be okay. Said that you. That's dealt with at least. Oh, don't have yellow yet. Ooh. Mm, ooh. Yum. Hey, thanks for cheering your bits. Oh yeah, I could totally do that. Yeah, I'll see, uh, I'll look into that program. Um, 
I'll see if uh, D would mind setting up a character. Because it'd just be like different facial expressions, maybe slightly different uh, body positions. So we'll see how that goes. Oop, right. They pop up. I always forget in this part. They, they pop up behind you. They'll sneak you like... Careful now. Careful now. It looks like there's something cool over there, but I don't want to drop down. Die. Whoops. All right, going into the maze. D is doing fine. I mean, we're all doing just okay, you know? Living life. I've been super busy, but, you know, whatever. Drawing, watching anime, living the dream. I mean, you know, I say that sarcastically, but honestly, I do really love the place I'm in right now. I always remember, like, back when I was living in, like, crappy house shares with people I didn't know. Uh, you know, nervous to interact with anyone because I thought they'd think I was weird. Um, that the ideal would be to just live in a house with other, other geeks, other nerds who like the same stuff and just, like, all of that. And that's, that's where I'm at now. And it's, it's really... Uh, yeah, it's still really good. It means we can we have like nights where we go watch a bunch of anime on the TV, on the big TV in the big room together. I don't have to watch it with headphones in my own bedroom, keeping it secret, keeping it safe. <laughs> Playing video games, it's cool. Wow. I got a kitchen that I can cook whatever I want in. I love cooking. I've gotten pretty good at it now that I can do it whenever. I don't know. I think now it's like I'm I'm older and like more uh, attached. So I'd I'd prefer to not live in a house share again, but I am gonna move to LA someday so uh um i probably have to because that city is expensive and it's probably just gonna get more expensive before i end up actually getting there but i think i'd have a better time in a house share i'm much more sociable now than i was and i i have way less trouble actually uh yeah, actually, like, talking to people and carrying on a conversation. Do, 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 do. Uh, that's not what I want. Do, 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 do. Right through here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I see him. I see him. He's coming. Okay. Oh, another one. Okay. Miss this whole whoa, miss this whole situation. What's going on there? Now oh, there's guys down there. Okay.
what do we got? I mean, one's doing fine. Uh, as far as I can tell. Posting a lot of Power Rangers and Transformers in the IRL chat, which is sick. So jealous of his collection. Um, it's also like, I'm not as big into Transformers, but I'm also like, I like him as like a fidget toy. So I'm considering getting into it. Aha! See, I knew there'd be more over here. Just had to wait. Oh, ho, ho, ho. yeah. Good stuff. And, ooh, ooh. Secret area. Supercharge it. How do I get back out? Oh, like this? Like this? How did it I'm gonna waste my supercharge? How do I leave? No. Oh, that's a door. That's... Dang it. Uh, I don't think he paints his figures, but... He definitely... He'll, like, do, uh... Posed photos, which are pretty cool. And he's always, like... Talking about, uh... You know... Giving little tidbits, which I love. I love some tidbits. Whoops. Man. Oh, whoa! I missed out on my supercharge. Because I was being dumb. Ah, uh, candle in the wind. Is that what that means? I don't know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Ah. Ah, uh, go down. Please. Oh, jeez. It's stressful. Whoa. God, something about that huge muscular pink figure just zipping through the halls. Oh, it's spooky. It's rot spooky, isn't it? Oh, crocky. Ah, that was not helpful. That was bad. No! Ah. <laughs> well. Mm, maybe I should turn down the difficulty a little bit. Maybe a little bit. Mm. Well, for now, let's give it one more shot. Because I'm pretty... Is this the second to last stage, I think? I think there might be ten, so it actually might be quite a ways away still. But, uh... Well, we'll see. Ah, that's the worst, is when you hurt yourself by just dipping a toe in the soup. That's not what I wanted. Yeah, I think uh, when you do just the images that snap back and forth, that's called being a PNG tuber. So I might give that a shot. Uh, I'd have to... S I mean, I'd pretty much just set it up so that uh, the corner I'm in currently would be... Um, just be Leom in front of basically the same background, just drawn instead. So I'll have to get a picture of that. Oh. 
Yeah, I'll see, uh, see how the program works, see if D is up for drawing it. Here we go! Ah! Stop it! Stop it! No! No! What if the, that's what the Doom Marines sounded like? Please, I'm just trying to make it home. All of these bloody demons around. And I'm just late for tea time. Oh my goodness. Oh my gracious. No. It's all going poorly on this St. Crispin's Day. Just because I'm big and burly doesn't mean that I have to be mean about it. I have a heart and a soul like the rest of them. Oh, you son of a butt. Ah, oh, feeling it though. I'm enjoying streaming regularly again because like... I don't know, every now and then I'm like, oh, maybe I should do this or that, and I go off in like a funk, and I just end up like stressing myself out. But it's like, I just need to keep a consistent schedule, man. That's that's all it is. I keep thinking, overthinking things like, oh, uh, it should be this day at this hour. Oh man, I gotta make sure to get the SEO. It's like, no, none of that. You just stream consistently, make good content, stream more often. The long, like the longer the stream, the better. And you know, not necessarily more often. I see lots of people who do it every day, but then they only do it for a couple hours. And it's like nothing, but you gotta, you gotta stream at least like, you know, three, I'd say four hours minimum, If but you can get away with three. And if you say it's a, sh on occasion, if you already have something of an audience, you can probably get away with a two-ish hour stream, but anything under two hours, unless it's something like a particular event. Like when I do uh, when I do board games, I can only do them for so long, so they end up only being like an hour or two. Yeah. Yeah, getting chat interaction is big help. Having a tuber, a V V model thing, would actually probably really help. I mean, so many of the people I know do now, and it's like, I'm not against the idea, it's just like, I also like the idea of being on camera. I don't know, I, I'll definitely look into it. Uh, I don't really personally like the 3D model VTubers, they just, it's, something's awkward about them. Um, I don't... You know, I'm not saying that they're, like, bad, necessarily. It's just, like, not my taste. You know, everybody who's into them, I get it. They're cute, but they're also, like... I don't know, something about the way they move is, like, a little uncanny to me. I'm like, eh, no, no. Ooh, it's weird. All I really want is a little guy where when I go map 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 he also goes map 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 I think that would be fun Yeah actually yeah I was just watching the other day I can't remember if it was yesterday or not I think it might have been Saturday or Sunday. Uh, this animator that I was on, I voiced on a project for them. Uh, it's Move PSA, so go check out in the Discord. Uh, go check out on my YouTube channel, which I'll drop now. Um, right? Yeah, go to there. And in my playlist, I have a Stuff I'm In playlist. The one that's Move PSA. 
with the little turtle and rabbit situation. I played Terry the tortoise in that, because it's a tortoise in the hair, you know, parody. I had a fun time with it. I think uh, I've learned a lot about acting since then, and it wasn't even that long ago, but like I've gotten some coaching and I'm like, I feel like I probably could have done a lot better, but I went all out, I committed. I'm, you know, I'm not embarrassed of my performance there. I just, you know, I'm just disclaiming. Oh, jeez. One health, dude. 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 Hmm. Yeah, uh, let's see here. Uh, ooh, you know what? Actually, oh, I have a really good idea. If that program works the way I think it does, I have a really cute idea in mind. Oh, 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 yes, 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 yes. Actually, I really want to do that now. I think it'll be really cute. Uh, yeah, I hope it works the way I think it does, because then I have a great idea for the background. Um, okay, uh, this is what happens every time I get all turned around in this part. I hit, I hit the switch, so I need to, oh, no, I already went in there. Got some shells. Hit the switch, so I gotta find the uh, the doorway that opened. There it is. Oh, wait, no, I already did this. I just gotta get out. What am I doing? Where is my head today? Who's out there? Who's out there in La La Land? Looking and laughing and leaping at my l expense. It cost me money. Yes, uh, I donated my hair. I tried to advertise it everywhere. I did a charity stream where uh, I cut my hair to donate it to Wigs for Kids, which I still recommend. Um, yeah, I still recommend that y'all donate to Wigs for Kids. Uh, and yeah, I, I 100 percented Banjo-Kazooie over one stream and cut my hair to donate it and uh, I still, I still plan to pay the 300 something dollars donation that I said. <laughs> it's gonna, before my next charity stream, cause I'm growing my hair back out to donate it again um, and do another charity stream. But uh, yeah, uh, before I do it again, I will make that donation. It's just, Ooh, it's expensive. It was one of those, like, every time you die, you... It, nope! You do one. Um, so, yeah. I plan to. I just... Oh, a little too big for my britches. My pants can only hold so much. So much leg. And thigh. And... Well, let's not beat around the bush. And butt cheek. There. Are you happy? Is that what you wanted? I don't even. Uh, 
Two foot long. That's pretty long. My hair, even when it was super long, my hair was uh only about 14 inches. It was a ton of volume. Like it was big. It was like very big and bulky and curly. But yeah, it was actually only like four. Oh right, uh, 14 inches long at its longest point. Uh, wait, where's... Oh, right. It'd be nice if I could strafe. I wonder if that's... Oh yeah, that's why I'm moving so fast. I have run to always on. I forgot that I said it for that, like right at the beginning of this. It's good, I mean, it's just getting, forcing me to play better. Because, uh, you know, the stakes are so much higher than that to me. Okay, so if I hold left trigger, I actually go slower, which is good because honestly, it makes it feel like iron sights kind of. It like makes me zoo focused in a little bit. Then if I let it go, going fast again. Please. Please, God, no. The Lord has abandoned us. And his name is Doom. What? I don't even think that sentence made sense. It made sense tense. Where, where am I? What's wrong with my brain? I'm tired. It's been a long... I mean, it's Monday, man. What do you want from me? I did not have a super restful weekend. I planned to. I, you know, rested my voice, but then I ended up still working on a ton of stuff, doing a bunch of writing. Um, so it ended up being... Yeah, pretty busy still. Whoop. Oh, hey! This is good. Go down. Go down. Thank you. Chain gun. I was hoping they just wouldn't be able to hit me in that little alcove, but actually they were having a pretty easy time of it. Ah! Yeah, I think I'm out for tonight. Miscellaneous Mondays are shorter, so that's the best I could do for now. So let's let's save it. I'll save over whatever this was. All right, and then yeah, we're gonna raid over to someone, so don't go anywhere quite yet. But uh, thanks very much. In fact, let me just. There we go. Hi, hi. Uh, thanks very much for watching. Please check out all my socials down below. Join the Discord. If you haven't yet, hang out with people like Vinny. Uh, check out that Stuff I'm In playlist. Check out all my socials. Subscribe, follow, all of that stuff. Check out the Archive channel, which is super cool. I'll toss that in as well. That's like, yeah, that's all of my past streams archive, except for like a couple that like messed up or were just test streams. Um, I keep looking over to see myself. Hmm? 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 <laughs> Anyways. Uh, yeah, we're gonna figure out who to stream over to now. So, let's see. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Uh, <laughs> I just turned and saw myself doing the thing with the turning. Um, a little, little kooky wacky tonight. Uh, yeah, let's see who is live right now. Oh, who to go to? Yellow Jacket Guy. Yellow Jacket Guy is an old friend who I actually, like, re-met randomly on a server recently. So give him some love. Let him know I sent ya. He's playing E's. You know, Y-Y-S. 
Uh, but yeah, let them know I sent you. Have a great next few days. I'll see y'all on Thursday. We're going to play Portents. Tell you, this guy. Portents. Christopher Chan's Portents. New Mill Industries. Super, super cute little uh, abstract game, and it's got a solo mode. Oops. Let me uh, mute him until we're ready. And then, uh, yeah. See you guys then. All right? All right. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.